How's it going, everyone? I'm Aaron Nick, and welcome back to Resident Evil Revelations. I am continuing on. I'm playing as Jill. I don't have any weapons. Uh, I'm trying to find my weapons. And this this point is actually... This might be, like, my favorite part of the game so far. Because of this, like, feeling weak. Oh, well, there's a shotgun right there, so... Maybe it's not going to last too long. But I, th I think it's cool. Like, I am, I'm searching for weapons. I'm trying to... Insert something. Okay, so I need to find an insert to get that. You know, it's it's different than the other points of the game has been so far. Because the first part, I, I mean, I started out with a gun, and then I was kind of fighting guys here and there. Well, was it comfortable in there? Did you enjoy your time in there? Uh, what's nice is having this mini map up top so I'm able to kind of see which rooms I have and haven't been in yet see which ways I need to, to check I don't have any tools I don't have anything so all I can do is just dodge when an enemy comes to get me well enjoy your meal snacky snack is he just licking the floor I thought he was hunched over a body but no he's just licking the floor Gross, man. Oh, I have to push this. Good thing he wasn't coming after me and just licking the floor. Alright, what do we got now? This is a big room. This is a big room inside a ship. I mean, I, I shouldn't be really surprised, but... I, I mean, this is, this is pretty damn big for... Anchor mark. Okay, so I need an anchor key to get in there. They're probably gonna open the place up for exploration soon. Jill, oh, hello. Okay? Yes. I'm fine, but the ship's crawling with BOWs. Okay, we're going to need our weapons. I think I saw them on my way here, but I couldn't reach them. We should be okay as long as we work together. Okay, retrieve weapons. So just going back the way he came. Wait for the door to close, then I can go through. Wait, there are more creatures this way. Okay. Think we can use it? Oh hey. Yeah, it just might do the trick. I was just using this. Oh wait, I didn't even know if this was the way I was supposed to go. Uh go get it. Go get it! You don't even care? Uh Oh, I don't have any healing items. I might need to use another decoy. They'll go past. So, oh, damn. That's, that is a lot of enemies. And he's still alive, so. Damn it! Alright. I made that out. And I'm dead. <laughs> okay, that wasn't cool, though. I mean, I, I probably could have dodged it, but... It, it was a little annoying because it doesn't exactly tell you, like, it, there's a good gauge on if I'm going to be okay or not with, I probably can't go there. Yeah, I saw the red and I figured I probably can't. Think we can use it? Yeah, it just might do the trick. So if I use, like, one per room. Just throw it that way. So, I, what the hell? Is in the, oh, this is the room I was. There we are. And I managed to dodge. Well, that was a lot of. Uh, I, and I, I hit Parker, so. I, I guess I'll consider that a success. Can't make it in that room. I don't know what this is. Customized. Oh, they have custom parts in this game. So, like, in, in Resident Evil 3, if you haven't played or haven't seen it, you're able to make custom ammo in that game. So, and then, um, they continued that on and, like, oh, here's all my stuff. So, I have all my stuff again. Ooh. And a lockbox. Put all my stuff in. Oh, cool. So, there, there's a stash. Oh, okay. So, this, this actually is quite a bit, like, uh, the old, old Resident Evil game. So, 
In in Resident Evil 3, they had customizable ammo where you can make different ammos. Um, then in Resident Evil 4, they started adding like customizations onto weapons. Now we contact HQ and tell them what the hell is going on. We should be able to do that from the bridge. Let's go. This is the room I was stuck in. Okay, then. I don't know what the deal with the guy in the yes mask is. I'm gonna find that out though. So then, yeah, then in, uh, you know, future Resident Evils, I didn't get any healing items. I I could use a healing item. All right. I just gotta scan anything. Can I scan things? Can I please scan things in this room? Get a healing item? Nope. Way to be a dickhead to me. Alright, so, yeah, so then, you know, five and... So, if why do you customize your weapons more? Which was actually kind of nice. Scan that. Anything over here. Because then... Oh, green air. Thank you! Alright. Yeah, I don't remember exactly where I was going with that. It, it was just that, um... It's cool that they're kind of that the roots are back a little bit and headshot and headshot, which actually down them pretty quick. Oh well, I didn't mean to throw a grenade. I meant to get to the scanner because I get items at the end of scanning stuff. Come on, headshots. And then you don't know when they're going down, so I end up wasting that last shot, but that's okay. I mean, what's one shot when there's... There seem to be handgun ammo laying around everywhere. And I can also just scan in rooms, find different items. I wonder... I hope there's no key items that I need to find with the scanner. That would be a... That would be a minor annoyance. And walking into a room next to an enemy is also a minor annoyance, but that's okay. Well, I thought he was dead. He had that, like, like he was going down face. Or does his shots just not do any, doing anything? Does a live sample get more? I think a live sample gets more. And do these guys stay hurt from the previous rooms? So, like, when I came through here and threw the grenade, did they stay hurt? I have so many like just random questions, but I don't think they're really getting an answered just because Custom part. Okay, so that's nice. I really didn't take a look at what custom parts do yet. I'm sure they do like exactly what you think they do. They make your weapon powerful or different things. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, they're freaking everywhere. Okay, so I think I heard another one. So there's at least one more in this room. Anything on these tables? Can they can they come back from being goop? Because that's what I'm kind of getting at. Like since they leave their bodies remaining. Because if they leave their bodies there, there's like only two reasons. One, so I could scan them. Which seems kind of just like, really, you just, you want to make the scanner work that much, they just leave their bodies there. But my main thought is that they might come back after I leave the room, so I might have to conserve more ammo. And that might have been the point of the dodging section, where I had to just avoid enemies with no weapons. Which, I kind of wish lasted a little longer. And, like as just Jill and not just as Jill and Parker in the room with the where he had like oh here's the randomly convenient grenades that I found that work on the enemies that we're facing. Um, there's another one. All right, got that one. And. 
Okay, then this. And this. There at least, though, so far, I haven't. I just realized I haven't fought any bosses or anything. Is that. Oh, it was, it was where he was licking the floor. He, he was licking the handgun ammo. Continue on. Okay, I would be slightly lost if I didn't have the mini map there. Now, how do I feel about the mini map? Overall, I don't really like it. It it makes it easy. It makes me makes it easy to look and see, you know, which rooms I could go into, which rooms I can't go into yet. Oh, I wonder what that room is like. Have I been in there before? Yes, I have. You know, I can see you know, I'm going back to where I was. So this... I don't know, this level kind of worked interesting. Like, I mean, I just called it a level, but... This section of the game, because I'm sure I'm going to be reusing a lot of these areas. Um, it is kind of like the first game in the fact that, like, the first game you're just trapped on a... You're trapped in a mansion. This one you're trapped on a boat. I don't know. Differences... I mean, I can see why people were saying that, like, it gets back to, like, some of the roots of the original Resident Evil. It's not scary. So, I'm, I'm waiting for it to, you know, get me with something, but... And all I'm facing right now is, I've always seen... Ooh. As I was saying. I've, I've always seen... Oh, shit. Can I... Please? Where's my guy? What the hell? I just like... What the hell? Like I walked into a room! The... That was... That was pretty bullshitty. Anyway, I guess. Why am I dying? I died twice now in this level. Area? Section? back in my oh are you kidding me and for the bridge all right guess I'll just go back so I was gonna say that I really haven't seen different types of enemies um that was just that was kind of just BS because they just trapped me in a corner I walked into a room in a corner and and Parker here wasn't you know with me so he wasn't able to be of any help all right just get back to where I was it really isn't too far away it's just a couple of rooms couple of guys but still I I'm, I'm slightly peeved about that one there, I remember an item in here Yep, these two guys Hello. And with some of these enemies so far, there's almost no reason to dodge. If you can just keep shooting them. Alright, I'm just going to go back in this room, grab the handgun ammo real quick. Because I remember the handgun ammo sitting right there. Right here. Then I will try and beat the fucking assholes in the next room. So, okay, so there's another variation on the enemies that I just saw. So, I want to try and go to the left, though, because this guy seems like he be. There we are. There we are. He's in the room now. So, at the very least, I have backup and someone shooting. I think he's... I think him shooting enemies does stuff. <laughs> he's just got, he's just got claws. And he's got claws on his face, and he's just like very clawy guy. Look at this guy. All right, all right. So yeah, conserving ammo is a thing.
considering I only got four shots. I and I used my grenade before. That would have been a good opportunity for a grenade. Anything on here? Okay, there's gonna be enemies popping out somewhere. I yeah. Alright, just dodge. Just dodge and leave. I don't think there's much. Nope, doesn't seem to be much. Alright, just leave. There's no reason killing an enemy in there when I don't need to yet. Well. There we are. Okay, and that's, um, that's an easy trick apparently to dodge enemies. Just keep pressing forward. Go through handgun ammo. Woo! Let's see, let's see. I'm so I'm making it to the bridge. Up. Ding. All right, head in here, and I think I'm gonna end the video. Bridge lower cabins. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video right here. So thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please go down below and let me know. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.